We look at anything from um, the tap to the analyzer on an analytical instrumentation system, um, right from the, the field conditioning, field stations, fast loop, sample conditioning, right up to the analyzer. And it's usually the sample system that feeds the analyzer that causes most of the problems to the uh, tune of about 80 plus percent. So the analyzer is not really the problem, it's the sample system that's the problem. So the niche that we're in is exactly where the pain seems to occur for the customer. So at a recent evaluation advisory service at an oil refinery in our territory, we had a system that was experiencing about a four to five hour time delay. So what that means is when a customer made a process change, the analyzer didn't see the change for four to five hours. So as you can imagine, in that four to five hours, a lot of product has made it past the analyzer. So if they were to find a bad result at the analyzer, they would have to either you know, rework the product uh, or scrap the product. So that's a huge cost loss to our customer. So by taking the, the whole system view um, and solving the issue of the time delay, we took it from about four to five hours to four to five minutes, the customer estimates that they'll save about a million dollars per year. So obviously that's a big return for our customer and, and having that, that instant feedback, the four to five minute feedback from the analyzer allows them to control their process much more tightly and in the, at the end of the day save about a million dollars per year. So uh, we were engaged with one of uh, the biggest um, petrochemical facilities uh, in the Middle East and uh, we were working with them on, on a process line uh, until their lab and when we reached the lab we find a lot of problems inside the lab. So we've been working with them on providing a very simple and small assembly to solve all the leak problems that they were having in their lab and it has been standardized over the 15 labs they have in the region. Uh, it, saves, it saved a lot of time, it's uh, very easy to maintain, and we built a good relationship with them. We would go out onto a site of a refinery, look at their grab sample stations. Um, if there's stations that aren't working, they're not getting clean samples, they're not getting samples that they can use in, in the lab, or the panels aren't working, we would make recommendations, do a redesign based on our expertise and knowledge, and then actually build those panels and provide them for them. So it would be a complete solution. Um, right from the, the findings to the delivery. We're moving now towards uh, systems which are much, much simpler and easier to understand, easier to integrate into or retrofit onto an existing system. So it's really exciting time and I think those, some of those things are going to be very impactful on, on our lives in the future and the customer and, and the way things are done in analyzer systems on our process plants.